Hello, I'm Dr. Slavin and in this video I will be showing you how to take a vulva vaginal swab. Depending on your symptoms, your doctor may have given you a pack with one or two swabs. A black topped swab which tests for bacterial vaginosis and thrush and or a yellow top bottle which tests for chlamydia and gonorrhea. If your pack contains a bottle with a yellow top, please use this swab first. Please remember that the bottle also contains a special liquid and to not spill the contents of this bottle. So now let us start with taking the swab. We first of all wash our hands. We will start off with taking the swab for chlamydia or gonorrhea. In your pack you will notice a clear bottle with a yellow top and two brushes. A swab which contains a mascara like brush and a swab which contains a cotton bud like brush. Please discard the brush which has a mascara like top and use the cotton bud. Remove the swab from the packaging. Be careful not to touch the top of the swab. Place the swab into your vagina about 5 cm and rotate it to ensure that it touches the vagina walls. Keep the sample within the vagina for about 15 seconds. Once you have completed this, remove it from the vagina. Then you take your bottle, remove the yellow lid. You will notice a black strip down the bottle. Snap this against the side of the bottle like this and secure the lid. Next, you should label your bottle with a small label. Get the microbiology form. Ensure that there is a big label on both the front and back pages if this, not, if this has not already been done. Ensure that the date and time is written. Once you are satisfied that everything is correct, place within the plastic bag and seal over. If your pack also contains a clear bottle with a black top, you will repeat the same procedure. You will open the, the swab pack and you will take out the specimen. In this packaging, it is quite different in that there is a black lid. This black lid should be removed. Again, you take your swab 5 centimeters into the vagina, rotate it round up to 15 seconds, and then when you're satisfied with that, once you have done the rotation 15 seconds, place it in the container and seal. Again, you ensure that there's a small label on this packaging, a small label on a large label on this form, both front and back, and then place the tube within the plastic bag and seal over. Please remember that this, if this is done incorrectly, the laboratory will not accept the specimen. Now, just for purposes of clarity, I will show you what the cotton wool sample looks like. It will be the exact same for the chlamydia swarm as it is for the bacterial vaginosis, just like a cotton wool. As thus, you will see the cotton wool tip. This is what you use for your chlamydia gonorrhea swabs as opposed to the mascara brush. Now you have finished the self swabbing, wash your hands once more and congratulations, you have completed this successfully.